All right. This is the five sizes of the, the wind killer, the long hair wind killer. And the way you can find the right size for, for your wind killer is that you can see at the bottom here that which kind of microphone is, uh, is made for. Or you can just measure the grill of your microphone and then find the right one. So that should be pretty easy. If you, if you can, uh, I messed a little bit up with this one and just make it uh, really nice. Nasty. And then you just shake it up back to shape. And it's the same thing when it's wet and uh, you just dry it and then you can shake it up again to the shape, uh, to the nice fur shape here. We have two more things. We have two more wind killers for the long hair one and this is the long hair uh, XL with a big mount. And that's for the MKH60 microphone. So this actually, it fits. And we have the same thing for the, for the MK50. And this is the extra small one you need for that one. And maybe we should, uh, should hear it a little. Uh, I'll just plug it in here. And let's see how windy it is today. All oh, right now, well, it's not that windy. We only got almost two meters per second. And that's, well, in Denmark, it's very light wind. But let's see how it works. Well, without, you cannot use it. Um, yeah, and then And then you have a nice, clean sound of it. Yeah. It's shipping now, the, the big mount for, for the XL, for the 60, and the X, uh, extra small for the 50. And another thing that is shipping now is the short hair wind killer. And I can show you that. The short hair wind killer we have down here. And it also comes in five different sizes. Oops. And two with a big mount as well. So you can go for your 60 and you can go for your 50 or 40 or 30 with this one. The difference between the long hair and the short hair wind killer is that the long hair wind killer can tolerate more wind than the short hair one. But the short hair one is very, very good for the cameras because the camera guys don't like the long hair. It will get into the picture. And I have seen a lot of guys who have been cutting it and uh, burning the fur or, and, and that kind of stuff. We can see it over here. Uh, if you have the long hair version on, and you can see it might interfere in the frame and all that kind of stuff. But if you take the, the short hair, then you won't have the problem at all. And you still get a very, very good wind protection out of it. It's kind of like the same over here when you have the Sankens CS1. Uh, and you have the short hair. And it's very effective and it's very, very good. So that's the news about the wind killers and um, yeah, thank you.